Clarence Gideon was born in Hannibal August 30th, 1910, and grew up in the 1900 block of Gordon Street. When he was 16, he dropped out of school and eventually became a drifter, ending up in Florida. In 1961, he was accused of burglarizing a pool hall. He firmly denied the charges against him, but since he was poor and couldn't afford a lawyer, Gideon had no choice to defend himself. This eventually led to his conviction. Feeling he was robbed of his 14th Amendment rights, Gideon appealed, and the Supreme Court ruled unanimously in March of 1963 he was not given a fair trial. He was retried and acquitted five months later on August 5th. Gideon died in 1972 and was brought back to Hannibal for burial. His grave remained unmarked until 1984 when the American Civil Liberties Union paid for a marker. Reporting for the Hannibal Courier Post, I'm Dominic Gennetti.